Now that we've put our script together, let's upload it to the server and see how it runs. We'll use our FTP client to upload it and then use our Telnet client to make sure that it's got the right file permissions. Because we've just uploaded it, it doesn't have the correct file permissions, so we'll need to change those. Now that we've done that, we can go over to our web browser and run our script on the server. The script carries out the query and returns a list of the records that it found in that particular table. This is a very simple select query that we've used in our script and we could get very much more complex with our SQL if we wanted. But what our focus is here is on the way in which Perl can carry out different kinds of tasks using the DBI module.